what's going on back there? To be honest, I have no clue. Let's go get some coffee and then we'll uh, come back and find out. That was the Sanibel Bean. I've only been to Sanibel Bean once before this. I got the Ice Mocha. It looks pretty good, let's give it a try. Yeah, that's a premium iced coffee drink. Uh, nice and mocha, you can see it's real chocolate, it's no fake pump stuff. I don't like black coffee, or really hot coffee, or really hot drinks at all. So I'm, I'm more of an iced coffee guy. Uh, call me girly if you want. I'll accept it. Next order of business, go find my father and have him tell you and me what, the, what in the world is going on on the causeway. I think he's on Fort Myers Beach, but I think he should be back soon. Let's go find him. Good morning. Hey, how are you? Grand. Say hi to the camera. Hi, camera. <laughs> <laughs> All right, turns out he's not here. It's a beach check. I'm down at Fort Myers Beach. I'm at the Best Western Hotel. But he will be at the causeway soon. So I'm gonna go meet him there. construction. Do you want to hop out? So. All right, back on the causeway with the man himself, Mr. Nick Adams. Um, he's the man with the plan, the man with all the info. Say hello. How you doing? <laughs> so what exactly are they doing on the causeway from your understanding? So I think it's a multifaceted job. They're stopping, they're, re re or they're nourishing the beaches from eroded sand, so that's been replaced. They're trying to put in, they're, they're putting in um, rock jetties and bollards. They're putting in rock jetties that are gonna stop lateral wind or water movement eroding the sand from the islands and they're also putting in planned parking so there's going to be dedicated parking they're going to pave some areas i believe and there's going to be so there's going to be somewhat less parking but it will be more organized there's talks of possibility of paid parking um, although they've only said it's a possibility although i somehow expect it will be paid parking so you're gonna they're gonna be about 50 percent of the parking spots on the island on a memorial day weekend there's around about 400 cars last memorial day and it's going to go down to about 200 ish uh dedicated spots so we'll see time will tell they haven't actually rolled out the plan as far as what the charges will be or how much or if they're even going to do it but judging by the way they're calling it or they're putting the park signs up i'm sure it's only the next step uh, but right next to us is the construction going on to do the actual beach nourishment and beach, uh, or basically uh, protecting the beach from erosion from wind and from uh, current. So Acor according to the, the plaque that we just read, the, the time lapse that you just saw of, of the, the construction is going into building a concrete slab, which I'm assuming is going to be used for parking, right? 
I presume. Yeah. 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 So the the beaches, what were once the beaches, are gonna be concreted over for parking or some of the beaches? No, I think it's just small areas. If you look at the plan, there's a lot of uh, uh, foliage has been planted, a lot of natural foliage. Um, but yeah, it's only small areas that are actually going to be parking, and that was part of the problem is that they're going to so that it can remain a natural looking natural looking islands. They're going to make it you know restricted parking. So I think that's the idea. I don't okay. think the idea is to concrete it everywhere, but it will be dedicated parking. Okay. When's it due to finish? When's it due to finish? I think middle of next year. Middle of next year. Linked below, uh, we have an aerial v video uh, with a few more details about what's going down. I just wanted to update you guys on what's happening. What else do we have to do today? Uh, today, you, we have a podcast. You were at Fort Myers uh, Beach. I they just shot that. Fort Myers showed, Beach. Yeah, saw that. Yeah, I just did a beach check this morning on Fort Myers Beach. And then we've got um, editing to do. We, and then we have a podcast guest this evening which will be coming out in about a week, I guess, about a week or two. Yep. Um, Laura from... Post Office the Post of Post Office Sanibel Sanibel Artist on Instagram. Yeah, um, yeah so we're doing the recording that tonight. After this, you'll be in for the behind the scenes of the podcast. I think that's about it. Check back for regular updates at thesandcapguide.com. I got a haircut. Looks fantastic. Behind the scenes of me setting up the studio for a podcast. Ready? Go. All right, now that all that's done, you go right here sit tight hello hello welcome to the sand cap guide podcast here we are tonight we're actually all right dad how are we feeling feeling good feeling good rock and roll yeah yeah what do we got going on waiting for a podcast to be recorded and uh, just taking a walk because we've been in the studio all day. Well, all afternoon. And it's been a long day and we're staying for to record a podcast. Are we getting dinner? Snackettes. I think snack then we'll go for dinner after, shall we? What do you think? Maybe a bit. I'm down. Yeah. Can we do a food review? We could do a food review somewhere, yeah. Alright, sweet.